I have high hopes, but no guarantees. The hunt for sagebrush lizards wasn't easy. Steep slopes, deep crevices, and incredibly ornate sandstone structures meant slow going. But then it happened. There he is, right there. Boy, they're fast. The reptilian carnivores are ant-eating machines. Only recently were they found in central Montana. They also occur down at Yellowstone Park around some of the thermal features. And they occur in the southeastern part of the state in some sagebrush arid areas. During the breeding season, which is winding down now, the males develop a brilliant blue chest and belly. They attract females by pushing that chest and belly up off the ground, exposing the blue underside. Montana is not really a lizard-friendly place. We only have four species that are native to the state. Sagebrush lizards have adapted by having a very short breeding season. It's only 30 to 40 days long. They also have a, that one of the shortest gestation periods for the egg. These lizards occur on the newly acquired Beckman Wildlife Management Area. This region is an important wintering area for mule deer. It goes to show that while the wildlife management areas are important for game species, it also can be a refuge and be an area that's actively managed for other non-game species such as sagebrush lizards. Cool, huh? Craig Jordanet, out amongst Montana's fish, cool wildlife, and parks. Ah. Oh, there.